for over a hundred years now, there has been one company that has dominated the beginner guitar market. A company that I am not gonna say, but I will say that it does rhyme with Flyer Flatacaster. And now we finally have more options. It's not always about getting better options. We just sometimes want more options. A little competition is a good thing. We finally have that competitor. We finally have our champion. We finally have that guy that's ready to get in the ring and throw some punches. Welcome back to the Working Class Musician YouTube channel. I am Jimmy Franklin, and today I have <laughs> Look at it, dude! It looks like it. It looks like it's gonna cost a thousand dollars. I have the Ibanez A Z E S. Okay, so I am going to talk up this guitar way too much because ever since the A Z S came out, for those of you who have been on my channel since day one, know that I think the A Z was one of the best guitars to come out in decades. And I still stand by that, 100%. Much like the bigger brothers of this that I've owned, which are the Prestige and the Premium, this is also an equally as impressive instrument that clocks in right around, it's either 300 or $350. It's still a slightly higher than average price guitar, but what are you getting for paying a little bit more? <laughs> Now you could start at either end of this guitar, but for me, I'm gonna start down here at the body. On this specific model, you get an HSS, which is available with some other brands. But in this case, I think it's super important to realize that not only do you get the five-way switch, but Ibanez was nice enough to give you the Dynamix switch. And this is, in this case, it's a Dynamix 9 switch. That means you have nine pickup configurations to choose from. When you are a beginner, you have no idea what you like yet. So having something like this is super valuable to just learning what you might want in the future. Not only that, you can get super stratty, glassy tones, and then you can get a hot humbucking Les Paul-esque scream out of it at the same time. Remember that I will have this guitar available below to pick up from our friends at Sweetwater. And if you're liking the video so far, hit the like button below to help it go out to more people. It really helps grow the channel, so thank you so much. <laughs> Something else that I think is super vital to this is, uh, let's see, yup, look at this. The year currently is 2022, and there is no reason anymore that we should not be carving heel joints. The fact that we've had to wait this long to get something like this to be stock on a beginner guitar is unbelievable to me, and it blows my mind. It's just so transparent, you like, oh man, I just remember thinking to myself like how much I hated having that big chunky piece of wood on the back of my first guitar. I remember hating having a big block. I'm so happy for the kid that doesn't have to deal with that, and maybe doesn't even know it, doesn't even know that we had big chunky heels on the back of the neck.
mentioned this a thousand times across the channel. I find it so important to have large strap buttons on a guitar. I, again, this is just something that should be stock. You can put a strap on your guitar with confidence that it won't fall off and not have to put strap locks on yet. You can afterwards, but just find out if you like the guitar first, then you can change them. Next up, what I love, up here on the neck, it is what they call the A-Z-E-S C-shaped neck. It's a little bit thinner now that I'm getting to know it than my A-Z, but it's still a very comfortable neck. <laughs> One of the things that I will tell you is we have these string trees up here at the top. Let's see, is it focusing? Excellent. So if you see these string trees right here, those can be replaced with little roller barrel string trees and they're super, super cheap and it will increase tuning stability. So it's worth looking into. But yeah, so far I'm having a great time messing around with this. I think it's a wonderful first guitar option. I just think they did an absolutely amazing job with this and I can't wait to play around with it and get to know it a little bit more. Ibanez killing it, tapping into this market. Absolutely wonderful job. This has been The Working Class Musician. I am Jimmy Franklin. I'm gonna go have more fun with this and I will catch you next time.